Before we start the video guys, I'd just like to ask if you can subscribe, comment and like for more content. Now let's dive in. Welcome back to the channel everyone, Hamish here, and in today's video we will be looking into whether or not lionfish are dangerous to humans. Lionfish have always been a hot topic of conversation amongst hobbyists and those interested in marine life. Their appearance is unusual to say the very least, sporting a red, orange and black coloration with deep stripes covering their bodies. But perhaps the most unusual and certainly most dangerous aspect of this reef fish is their venomous spines that cover their pelvic, anal and dorsal fins. Biologists and experts alike have labelled lionfish as one of the most dangerous fish in the ocean. And despite there being no recorded deaths from lionfish, Anyone looking to keep a lionfish as an addition to their home aquarium must be cautious as a sting from their toxic spines could easily cause infection, negative reactions and intense pain. However, this certainly isn't to say that you should not keep a lionfish as your pet as they are awesome fish to observe and look after. I mean, you just have to look at the name of this channel and my website. But you should do so with caution, treating them with the respect that they deserve. Fortunately for us humans, they are typically not aggressive towards us, with attacks being down to self-defense when they are feeling threatened. So, are they poisonous? Despite popular belief, lionfish are not actually poisonous, but they are highly venomous. In fact, lionfish are eaten in many different countries and are considered to be somewhat of a delicacy. Their spines and fins are their only source of venom. The venom is specifically located at the tip of each spine and at the point of their sharp fins. Lionfish typically showcase between 11 to 18 dorsal fin rays, depending on the size and type of lionfish, that are highly venomous. But this is all for their own protection, and they do not intentionally want to cause damage towards humans. When keeping your own lionfish or encountering one in the wild, you will need to avoid touching or being close to the fins or spines of your lionfish, due to them acting out of defence. They may think that you are invading their territory and launch an attack. Despite not being deadly or life-altering for the majority of people, a lionfish sting can and will likely be a painful affair. Typically, after being stung, swelling starts to appear around the sting area, with the addition of bleeding, numbness and bruising. Whilst most people will not need to go to hospital and can recover from the sting without any medical support, it isn't a nice experience, and if you are unlucky or do not remove the sting immediately after being stung, the following symptoms can occur. Shortness of breath, fainting, swelling of the face and throat, fever, cardiac arrest, temporary paralysis, nausea, headaches, dizziness, and convulsions. If you are an experienced fish keeper, which you definitely should be if you are looking after a lionfish or multiple lionfish, you should be aware of the dangers caused by touching them or being touched by them anyway. Remember, lionfish are territorial fish and deserve to be respected. If they feel threatened, they will sting. So, unlikely scenario occurs, here's what to do. Clean the area with both soap and fresh water. Use a cloth or towel to control the bleeding. Apply heat to break the venom down, take some medication for the pain, use an ice pack to reduce the swelling. And guys, there we have it. Please try not to get stung by a lionfish, but if you do, at least you know what to do now. And thanks for watching. Please make sure to like, comment and subscribe for more fish keeping content. And check out the full article on lionfishlayer.com.